YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Booba, and welcome back to another video on the channel. I hope you guys are having an incredible day. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the most meta players to use in the new Peps Legacy Evolution. Honestly, boys, I think that this is the best evolution that we've gotten so far in FC24. If you guys do enjoy these kinds of videos, let me know by leaving a like, and then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new. It would be greatly appreciated. But without further ado, boys, let's go ahead and jump into it. Peps Legacy, 75,000 coins or 350 FC points. And if we go ahead and look at the player requirements, man, the max pace is 90 we have 86 dribbling 81 physical has to be the left back position and the number of play styles cannot exceed eight and he can't have any play style plus and honestly boys there's so many fantastic players that you can go ahead and use in the evolution and some of the upgrades are absolutely mental but yeah boys if we jump on over to football we can go ahead and check out some of these cards and the first player that i do want to go ahead and showcase is kamavinga now the one thing that i really like about this one now keep in mind it is 75,000 coins or 350 fc points yeah 350 fc points now this is just upgrading the regular rare Kamavinga. I feel like this could be a pretty solid option for anyone that's just starting off with FC24. If you have like a cheeky uh, Kamavinga in your club and you are looking to evolve a player, he could be a pretty decent option. Now, the one thing that I love with the card is his versatility, boys. He can play the left back and also the center mid position, so you could potentially use him as a box to box midfielder. And if we go ahead and look at the in game stats, he has 80 pace, 70 shooting, 88 passing, 87 dribbling, 78 defending, and 82 physical. A very well rounded player. And the one thing that I absolutely love with the card is that he has five star skill moves and five star weak foot boys for this early in FC 24. That's a huge W. And honestly, if we go ahead and let's say you want to use him as a box to box midfielder and you want him to be a bit more of a defensive player, then I would probably recommend the shadow chem style 88 pace right there with 85 defending should be very solid as a center mid. And yeah, man, again, with the versatility, he can play the left back position, the center mid position. I feel like that he would be a pretty solid card for anyone starting off with FC 24. The next player on the list, boys, is going to be the Inform Grimaldo card. Now, Inform Grimaldo is currently extinct on the market, which is a bit unfortunate, but an 86 rated card can now become a 91 rated uh, Pep's Legacy Evolution card. And honestly, man, he looks absolutely incredible. So same thing with Kamavinga. Grimaldo does have a lot of versatility with the card. He can play the left back, left mid positions. And if you can go ahead and manipulate your formation just a tad bit in game and maybe play him as a center mid, I feel like that could be a pretty solid option as well. So the fully evolved card does have four star skill moves and four star weak foot 91 pace with 90 acceleration and 91 sprint speed the shooting stats could be a little bit better if you do want to go ahead and play him as a center mid you would probably want to go ahead and throw on a chemistry style to help out with that just so that he can be a bit of an attacking threat as well incredible passing at 93 he does have 94 vision with 93 short pass and 89 long pass a 91 dribbling a very important stat as well he does have 91 agility 93 balance 90 reaction should be extremely quick and swift on the ball and then his defending and physicality are two decent stats nothing too crazy but yeah boys if you do want to go ahead and play him as a center mid you can probably go ahead and give him the hunter chem style it's gonna give him uh, 99 pace overall with 80 shooting so he can definitely be a bit of an attacking threat as well but if you do want to go ahead and play him as a left back or as a left mid then probably the shadow chem style just to make his defending even better in game and to again give him that 99 pace i mean just look at the stats boys if you go ahead and give him the shadow chem style if we go ahead and look at this chart right here he does become a 93 rated left wing back with the following play styles incisive pass play style plus dead ball whipped pass anticipate and tiki taka i think out wide he could be a phenomenal phenomenal player the next player on the list, boys, is going to be our very first hero card for the evolution. It is none other than Captavia. He can become a 91 rated card, which is absolutely incredible. Now, if we go ahead and look at his playstyles real quick, he does have the incisive pass playstyle, plus quick step, relentless, and tiki taka. And with the upgrade, man, I think that he's going to be one of the best left backs in the game. He does have four star skill moves with five star weak foot. And if we just go ahead and look at some of his in game stats, 85 pace, pretty solid for a fullback. 80 shooting, not that bad of a stat either. 89 passing, absolutely incredible. 91 short pass. 90 long pass 88 curve the dribbling isn't half bad as well now his agility and balance isn't anything too crazy 77 and 78 but he does have a whopping 94 reactions with 88 ball control and 91 composure should be very good on the ball as well potentially you can go ahead and play him as a left mid in game as well if you want and if you go ahead and give him the shadow chem style it's going to give him a 93 defending man 96 interceptions 91 defensive awareness 96 stand tackle and 94 slide tackle probably one of the best left backs in the game and for 75,000 coins that's a huge huge w up next boys we do have another hero card and this one is potentially one of the most op cards in the game now a lot of people do use the ucl bompastor card in game now you can go ahead and evolve the base hero card to become a 91 rated card again and some of the stats man let's go ahead and just start off over here four star skill moves five star weak foot incisive pass play style plus dead ball 
uh, whipped pass, anticipate, press proven, quick step, relentless, tiki taka. There's probably a few more. The card is also very close to becoming Hillet Gang, 88 pace, 84 shooting, 93 passing. 90 dribbling, 84 defending, 76 physical, a very well-rounded card. A lot of versatility with the card as she can play the left back, left mid, and left wing back position. And if you do want her to just be a defensive-minded player, then I do think that the shadow is going to be the best chemistry style for that. It's going to give her 96 pace with 97 acceleration and 95 sprint speed. And then she's also going to have 91 defending with 96 interceptions, 87 defensive awareness, 96 stand tackle, and 93 slide tackle. Wow. And with the Shadow Chem style, she does become a 93 rated left back, which is honestly insane this early on in FC24. Now, let's say you want her to be a bit more of an attacking threat. Let's say you want to play her at the left mid position. Then I think the Hunter and the Engine would be two really solid options. If you go ahead and give her the Hunter Chem style, she's going to have 96 pace with 97 acceleration and 95 sprint speed. And she's also going to have 90 shooting boys, 88 attacking positioning, 89 finishing, 95 shot power, what else could you ask for and the only reason that i would go ahead and recommend the engine chem style is that if you do want to go ahead and help out with her balance just a bit she does only have 79 balance and with the engine it is going to give her 88 agility with 87 balance and 99 dribbling as that subcategory so that's another great option right there up next boys we do have another player that is currently extinct on the market which again is a bit unfortunate but it is in form alaba alaba's in form card is an 86 rated card he can play the center back and the left back positions if you go ahead and throw him into the evolution he becomes a 9 91 rated card which is insane now there's also another thing that i did see with the card if you go ahead and put him first in the team of the week upgrade evolution and then into the peps legacy evolution he becomes a 93 rated card which is honestly ridiculous but if we just go ahead and look at this evolution right here without the team of the week upgrade he does have four star skill moves five star weak foot incisive pass play style plus dead ball anticipate and tiki taka and again man we just see an extremely extremely well-rounded card he's very close to being hooligan apart from his shooting but i do think that that Alaba is best as a defensive player you can go ahead and play him as a center back if you go ahead and play him as a center back and give him the shadow chem style he's gonna have 89 pace with 95 defending 98 interceptions boys 96 defensive awareness 95 stain tackle and 98 slide tackle boys whoever has this informed card w and again boys even if you go ahead and play him as a left back i do think that the shadow is still going to be the best option now a lot of people are saying the anchor chem style Okay, his strength and aggression could probably be a little bit better. With the anchor, he does have 85 pace with 85 acceleration and 85 sprint speed. The defending, really, really solid. He does have 94 defending with that. And then 86 physical with 90 strength and 86 aggression. Yeah, the anchor chem style could be a very solid option for the card as well. And then last but not least, boys, and one of the best evolution cards, if not the best evolution card that I've ever seen in FC24 is finally here. We have Joao Cancelo, a 92 rated card. One thing that I found very, very very cool with the card is that with the evolution he does have five star skill moves and five star week for for a fullback is absolutely incredible and if we go ahead and look at the different play styles incisive pass play style plus whipped pass block technical flair first touch trivella tiki taka he can honestly do it all and if we go ahead and look at the end game stats man 83 pace i would highly recommend a chemistry style to help out with that 78 shooting you probably won't be put into many situations where you are shooting with Cancelo a whopping 95 passing boys if you want to go ahead and use him as an overlapping fullback that's going to be very effective for a fullback 90 dribbling is very good as well 85 agility 84 balance 90 reactions and 92 ball control should be very quick and swift on the ball and then last but not least 84 defending with 75 physical now the top three community voted for the chemistry styles is uh 60 are saying the shadow chem style the shadow is going to give him 91 pace with 96 acceleration and 87 sprint speed and then it's also going to give him 91 defending and i do think that he could use a bit better defending so 91 is absolutely incredible right there 93 interceptions 87 defensive awareness 95 stand tackle 95 slide tackle all of these different play styles he has five star skill moves five star weak foot if you do have this in form card untradeable or in the club you're set for a fullback for the rest of FC24. Now, really quickly, boys, I just want to go ahead and check out some of the popular players. So the most popular player right now on Footbin for the evolution is Alaba. And this is what I was talking about. So his informed card put it first into the team of the week upgrade and then into Pep's legacy becomes a 93 rated card. That's honestly ridiculous. The second most popular one is Cancelo. And then we do have this chick, a 96 rated card. Four star skill moves, five star weak foot. I mean, it's a 96 rated card. She doesn't really have uh, stats to, uh, to to make sense for the 96 rated card, but that's pretty cool right there. We have Bompastor, Captevilla, uh, Grimaldo, and then 
Hey boys, I also want to go ahead and show you guys this. Cancelo, if you go ahead and just evolve his regular rare gold card, he becomes a 91 rated card, so that's really cool as well. And yeah, boys, honestly, just one of the best evolutions that we've gotten so far in FC24. But that is going to be the end of today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, let me know by leaving a like. Comment down below what player you guys are going to use in the evolution. And then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new. It would be greatly appreciated. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video. I've been your boy Booba, and I'll catch you guys in another one very, very soon. Peace.